In this segment, we'll familiarize you with the Live View controls and the menu's layout. Live View mode is the default view and will display all the connected cameras on screen. Click a camera's play button to activate it. You can double click an active camera to view it full screen. You may also click and drag a channel to reposition it. Right click the mouse to display the menu bar. Choose the menu button to open the menu. Now, enter your username and password to access the menu, then select OK. You can also select multiple camera views. Select playback to review recorded events. Select the speaker to mute or adjust the volume. The battery indicator shows the hub's current battery level. The network connection shows your current connection status. The recording icon indicates the camera is currently recording. The PIR icon indicates a camera has detected one or more warm objects. The battery icon indicates a camera's current battery level. To access the camera toolbar, select an active channel. Select the movie camera to start or stop a manual recording. Tap zoom to magnify an area of recording. Then mouse over the area and use the scroll wheel to zoom in or out. Select the light bulb to enable or disable the camera's siren and spotlight. Right click anywhere on the screen, then select the menu icon, and then select setup to open the main menu. The main categories are shown on the left. Selecting a category will reveal subcategories, allowing you to alter the settings. Make sure to apply your changes to save them. The display tab allows you to change the output resolution and change the menu's transparency. The camera tab allows you to rename cameras, set the post record time, view camera firmware, view battery levels, and unpair cameras. The record tab allows you to select the stream mode, set the recording schedule, and enable disable audio. The alarm tab allows you to alter motion detection parameters, control the siren, define a motion detection area. The system tab gives you control of some of the most basic functions of the NVR hub, such as device name, language, and video format, date and time, and general device information. To power off your NVR hub, select the menu and select Shutdown. Then select OK. Now, enter your username and password to access the menu, then select OK. For more information on the various options available, log on to support.swan.com and search Max Ranger Manual.